a story behind every door, and this is a good one. This is the fifth round of the top billing win a room makeover competition, and we're about to surprise Fatima Mohammed with the news that she's just won a garden patio makeover with 50,000 Rand. I love my job. Let's go put a smile on her face. A mother studying social work and volunteering whilst raising her own children could use a little luck. Are you the same Fatima Mohammed that entered the top billing winner room makeover competition? Yes, I did. Well, in that, say, in that case, come on out here. You could be anyways. I am very happy to tell you that you have won. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy. What I can I say? Won. Is that a nice present yes, or what? Yes, Fatima has a vision for this space. Well, Nico, this is my garden. I've tried to do something, but as you can see, I've battled a lot. What is your dream garden and patio area? Well, I put all my sons first. They're soccer fanatics. Mm -hmm. They actually need a space where they can play. Instead of them going to play outside, they can go in the yard. Grass was not an option, as the upkeep is high and not very water-wise. But our winner room makeover consultants, Dion Lorenz and Lisa Skoltz, had bigger plans. Lisa, it looks like you're really full of ideas. What do you think of the space? Can you do something here? Definitely. I'm very excited about the space. It's got a lot of potential. I love the fact that it's enclosed. It makes it easy for us to do something with a lot of impact in here. This tree at the end of the space is beautiful. It softens the space. It's a nice focal point. Do you anticipate any challenges here? The problem is to, to make it feel like a coherent space. I think there's a lot of different textures and walls at the moment, but I think a clever use of colour will fix that problem. If we can get the flooring to look uniform, we're basically halfway there. The exterior was being primed. We added quarry gravel to even the ground and invited style expert Claire Bond to consult on colour. Her suggestion, Plascon sparkling water. It already looks like a completely different space. How are things progressing, Dia? The primer is on the wall. The flooring is halfway there now. We've got the compacting going on, and soon the AstroTurf will be going in. And I think those elements working together will really open up the space to the design elements and the furnishings. And Claire, let's talk about colour. What is better in a space like this, light or dark? Look, you can go either way, but in this particular space, we've decided to go lighter. And if you're going to go lighter, it's very important to use a matte paint. It covers imperfections. It's also going to open the space up enormously. Well, two boys are going to be kicking balls around in this garden. Obviously, you need a certain kind of paint. Yes, all in all is the most fantastic paint because it, it's got a, a dirt barrier to it in its formulation. So it sort of inhibits mold. It's stain resistant. You can wipe your walls down or hose it down and it stands the test of time. On the family's day out, whilst the makeover was being completed, 13-year-old Shiraz and his six-year-old brother, Faisan, were in their element. Me and the boys, we are living alone, yes, but we manage every day through support through family and friends. My mom is a great mother. She motivates me to do well at school, in my sport. To have a patio and garden, it would mean a lot to me and the boys. It would mean having a space to relax and me not to worry, having him play outside in the road. Fatima is an avid reader, so one of our priorities became a daybed, ideal for her to keep an eye on her boys whilst finishing the next page turner. But first to try it was Telcom's Cajiso Moncho. I know it's lovely out here, but what are you, are you busy working? I'm just busy setting up, uh, making sure that the Mahomet is indeed connected by Telcom. We'll be giving them at my fire router, as well as data for 12 months. This allows them access to the internet and uh, also they can connect multiple devices, including this laptop that we'll also be giving away to them. They're getting so much more than they bargained for. What does that mean for the Mohammeds? Most importantly for the kids, it's important that their future starts today and therefore we seamlessly connect South Africans to a better life. Technical specialist Daniel van der Merwe would make our exterior decor using PPC cement. Well, I always say cement is like flour. You can do an incredible range of diverse things with it. And you can build from houses, bridges, to flower pots or jewellery. So what are we going to do and what do we need? What's the ingredient list? Usually if you make concrete, you will mix sand with concrete, which gives you a bulk, with uh, cement, and then of course water. Water is very important because that activates the concrete and it sets it in motion, which is a process called hydration, to create the strength and to bind all the elements together. And from there, we're gonna be pouring it into our mold, into our outer mold, but before we do that, we need to add a release agent. 
Once you've poured your candle holder mixture into the mold, spray more releaser agent on a canister top and insert it to create a space for your candle to sit in. Leave everything to set and cure for 6 to 12 hours, then press out the finished product, sand, and you have functional all-weather outdoor decor. Absolute perfection. That looks perfect. So what we're going to do is we're going to add a little tea candle in it yeah. for the Muhammad family to light up tonight. Mm. Neither men nor boys can resist a basketball net, while the plants and furniture are sure to make mum happy. Well, guys, I must say, this is a huge success, incredible transformation. Take me through what you did. I think the choice to put in AstroTurf really opened up the space, and it actually, I think, makes it quite an enjoyable, cool space, which the family will be able to enjoy for many years to come. I know the boys are going to love this, and Fatima as well, because she wanted something that's, that's easy to maintain. Yes, we've gone for a complete low-maintenance solution. The plants are hardy and evergreen, it's just beautiful. And we've got the day bed where she can relax, we've got a picnic table with a gas fire, and we've kept enough space for the boys to run around and play ball. Well, I have to say, you guys managed to cram so many elements into this one space, but it all fits perfectly and it's so well balanced. Job, very well done. So, I know we said we're going to do your garden and your patio, but we decided if we're doing the back, we might as well do the front, right? So we did do the front, and this is what we came up with. What do you think? Wow, nice. Unexpected, I love it. Thank you. When I count to three, take your hands off. Are you ready? Yes. Three, two, one, action! <gasps> wow. <laughs> it looks stunning. And it's basketball also. Therese, what do you think? I think it's fantastic. It's a wonderful makeover. What's your favorite part, Fatima? <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm speechless, but I love it a lot. Really, it's, it's stunning. I wouldn't have been able to do anything like this. <laughs> That's not all. This is your real space. We've also created for you a virtual space in the form of a laptop computer <laughs> and a year's connectivity. Compliments yeah. of Telcom. One whole year. What are you going to go first? With the garden games or online? Both. <laughs> <laughs> no more fighting about anything. You've got so much to do and so little time. Fatima, how do you feel? Well, at the moment, um, I'm trying to calm my heart, but I would just like to say from my family, thank you to Top Billing. We really appreciate this and I love it. Well, from us, from the whole Top Billing team, it's such a pleasure. Enjoy. It's all things to the family. Party Central, an outdoor games room, a sanctuary to read and study in, and a space to create fantastic memories.